Now we're gonna look at the difference between the 101P and the 105. 105 is very similar to the 101P in that you turn the dial to confirm all of your settings. One of the differences is that you have a plus button and a minus button, as well as an OK button to set your time. Another difference is the plans. So in this one, you only have one plan to choose from instead of three. The other difference is when you're on the on section, the 105 has a delay mode to prevent excess water in your garden. Here you hold the delay button for three seconds. And now your next watering will not start for another 11 hours and 14 minutes. This always sets to 12 hours. Just like the 101P, the 105 has a manual override mode to give your garden some extra water in case it's really hot outside. Click and hold the manual button. And you'll hear the pop sound. And from there, it'll water your garden for 10 minutes. If you want to turn it off, click and hold manual again, turns it off. Or, if the manual mode is on, all you have to do is turn the dial and it's off as well. As you saw in the video, the 101P is a very comprehensive controller that is able to handle most of your daily watering needs. The 105 is a simpler version, but it's also still able to handle your daily watering needs. I hope after this video you were able to make a decision based on what you will need in your garden. See you next time.